wish I knew how they fly. Yeah! Like their wings help them float on the air. Mm. I've got an idea. We can't fly, but maybe I can make something that flies. With my sandwich paper! You'd better blow the crumbs off it first, then. Darwin, look! Titiro! See how the paper goes up when I blow across the top? Interesting. My paper! We have to go get it! It's flying pretty well! Come on! The paper's flying because it's really light. I can nearly reach it! Careful, Newt! Wait for it to land! can do it, little friend! Look! Tetero! Nothing to worry about. Kia will show you how. Manawiti, which means little bird. He is trying to teach him how to fly while his mum's away getting food. Wow! I think I'll watch and learn too. Sure! He is finding it hard because Manawiti's a little scared about being up so high. Oh, that's no good. Come here, Manawiti. I'll help you down. <laughs> Wow! He hardly weighs a thing! Birds have hollow bones, which make them really light for flying. Hmm. Light things fly. Birds and paper. I think we should start the flying lesson down here on the ground. Great idea! Come by! Okay, Kia. Are you ready to show Manawiti how to fly? Yeah. So strength is really important to be able to fly. Manawiti, can you use your strength and spread your wings out? And we will run with you! them helps you fly. You can do it, Manawiti. Maybe we should show Manawiti all the reasons she's built for flying. Let's science it. Your bones are hollow, Manawiti, so you're really light. Perfect for flying. That's good. Car pie. You're really strong too. So, 
When you flap your wings and stretch them out, the air flows over the top. The shape of your wings makes air flow faster over the curved top. And the slower air underneath pushes your wing up. So, Manawiti, you are designed perfectly to fly. Hey, I've got an idea. Titi. Look, Titiro! It's Manawiti's mom! <laughs> <laughs> 